The Mazda Miata, also known as the Mazda MX-5 or Unos Roadster, is a car that's near and dear to many car enthusiasts' hearts. The nimble two-seat Roadster is an absolute blast to drive and is a fantastic choice for anyone, but especially for young car enthusiasts looking for something affordable and fun. And here's why. First, let's rewind a bit and talk about the history of the Mazda Miata. The Mazda Miata came bursting onto the scene in 1989 in a range and variety of different colors, but most iconically in red. Mazda built a car that took inspiration from British roadsters with the fun two-seater convertible and to the Japanese aspects of reliability, high build quality and a soft top that doesn't leak. This small car quickly took over the car scene thanks to its lightweight design, agile handling and simple yet classic styling. This trend has continued in every generation of the Mazda Miata up until today, with the ND being arguably the best MX-5 ever made. But personally, there's just something special about the first generation NA Miata. Let's talk about the driving experience. Despite its low horsepower, the Miata is an absolute blast to drive. I mean, it's basically a road legal go-kart and you'll quickly forget it has less horsepower than a Camry when you hear that engine scream all the way to 7,500 RPM. And thanks to its lightweight design and 50-50 weight distribution, it's agile and nimble, and is an absolute joy to toss around corners. The lack of any modern technology such as ABS and trash control forces you to learn the skills to drive without any of these modern technologies holding you back. And it's low enough horsepower that you can't really get yourself into trouble, at least not easily. Plus, with a convertible top, you can enjoy the wind in your hair as you race around the mountains. And of course, the Miata has one of the largest and most welcoming communities out there. No matter what aspect of car culture you're into, whether it's drifting, stance, keeping it clean, or even off-roading, there's a Miata community that shares your interests. Most people are really friendly, and I've had tons of people at car meets or even on the street just come up to me and want to chat about our cars. You're joining a car community of passionate and friendly car enthusiasts who welcome you with open arms. Whether you're looking for advice on modifying your car, or just want to chat with people who love Miata as much as you do. You'll find plenty of support in the Miata community. And you can always count on getting a headlight wink as you pass another Miata owner on the street. Another great thing about Miatas is the large aftermarket support that there is for them. There are countless online forums, articles, and video tutorials such as ours, which means you'll have plenty of resources and support as an owner. There's also a ton of aftermarket mods available. Everything from small mods such as cup holders, pod filters, to whole engine swaps, forced induction, drivetrain swaps, I can guarantee you, if you can think it, someone's already done it in a Miata. This means you can easily customize a mod your Miata and make it your own, making it perfect for newcomers to the car scene. And they're one of the most reliable, fun cars you can buy, mostly because it doesn't make much power, but also because Japanese cars from this era were just built different. And Mazda took no shortcuts when building the Miata. It's robust, and even if something does break, it's super easy to work on and parts are really cheap. Finally, let's talk about the nostalgic experience of driving a Miata. With its classic styling and raw driving experience, the Miata is like a time capsule straight back to the 90s. It's an experience that modern cars just can't give you. The lack of any kind of electronic assists, modern features, and if you're like me, lack of any aircon, takes you back to a time when cars were simple. It feels at home in the mountains, but it's also a joy to drive in the city streets. And as someone who daily drives a Miata, I can tell you there's nothing like cruising around in a car that's older than you are. And that's why the Mazda Miata is fantastic for anyone that loves cars, especially if you're just dipping your hands into the car scene. Whether you love Japanese cars, drifting, modifying cars, or just appreciate a good sports car, there's a reason why Miata is always the answer. If you're a Miata owner yourself, let us know in the comments below what you love about your little two-seat roadster. And if we've convinced you to buy a Miata, check out our previous video on five reasons why buying a Miata kind of sucks sometimes. But until then, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.